All right. Welcome back, guys, to Death Road to Canada. Yesterday, we kind of cut it off short. Like, I, I don't normally go just, like, under an hour. Or try not to, anyway. But had to work, unfortunately. This time, I'm off, so I'll be able to do more. Let's continue where we were. Last time, we were... We only had Saro left, and she caused the death of Chamus, because, you know, she didn't have... I didn't know she had low loyalty. I really thought she would have more. And we decided to spend a lot of our food on a witch. Just to... just to see. We'll drive on the death road and decide to make a stop for supplies. A frozen friend? I've never gotten that before. Well, it's gonna be super dangerous. Let's do it. May as well dive. The group is driving on a warm forest road when they spot an out-of-place patch of snow. Whatever is causing the snow is also attracting a lot of zombies. Bring some guns, bring some ammo. Apparently she has a Uzi or something. <laughs> We're out of ammo on that already? Really? Mm. Oh, she took all the ammo. Weird. A witch with an Uzi. Well, five bucks says that uh, Sarah's probably gonna die. We don't have any other guns. Uh, I wanna keep giving her the light stuff at least. Yep, it's a witch with an Uzi. Huh. She has a claw. I don't know if that's necessarily good. that is, but it reminds me of Lady Gaga somewhat, and, oops, had a security pop-up. A caveman is frozen in a giant hunk of ice. There is really no way to get the caveman without blasting the ice into chunks, preferably with guns. This could take a while unless you have strong weapons. Really, that worth it? I mean, I really don't know. I've never done it. I don't think claws are good. Well, almost. Oh, hey! I overslipped! Okay, but doesn't understand the mysterious ways of the future, present, and campfire gun. She is very. She is capable of very high amounts of maximum strength and fitness. She needs several training lessons to meet her, reach her max, her full potential. Leave her, recruit her, ask for fighting tips, ask for survival tips. Recruit her! That looks like Ayla! The group accepts cavemen to the team. Cavemen joins the team. Onward. Strength and fitness is terrible right now, though. She's gonna die, isn't it? No. Whatever. We got caveman. We may as well just leave then. <laughs> That's the only thing here. We're gonna be without food. Damn it. In the top of camp, there's been a lot of. There's a lot of signs of bandits today. Someone needs to, st to be awake in case of an attack. We should stay up on watch. Uh, well, Sarah won't, because she sucks. Uh, which has zero... We have no idea. Oh, wow! Hey! We know almost everything about Sarah, except for fitness, which is probably shitty. 
we just know it's that's all we know. We don't know for sure. We just pretty sure she is. Uh huh. And you have Oh, you have above average strength and fitness. That's good. Hmm. I don't think Caveman's gonna probably work out in the end because we can't just focus training on the deadly road like this. But we don't know anything about your loyalty or the of the witch's loyalty. The witch remains angry that she couldn't bring her cauldron. And is a fighter from pre-civilization, recently thawed from ice. Hmm. We're probably better off just to keep driving and not be... Because I doubt either have good loyalty. Nah, you know what? Let's just try Caveman, I guess. Because I don't think the witch will. Oh! She managed to stay awake but feels pretty bad in the morning. She has above average loyalty. Oh, good. <laughs> She's not the best option for this, but... Oh, we're out of food. I wonder how many others get frozen in ice, like I do all the time. Uh, they get some gas and car repair and tune-up. No one knows how to do that. Alright, we need food. Infested Stronghold or Bookstore? Infested Stronghold, that'll probably have food. I'm gonna give you that, because you need to be able to carry something else. And I'll be playing as Saro, I think. Here, finish them off. Shotgun shells, nice. Yeah, chunk. We mainly need food. Nope, nothing, nothing, nothing. Get out. Let's get out of this house. This house is useless. Nope. Good finisher. Alright, Caveman can't really defend. It can just finish off. Really, because he, he's uh, a little too slow. Hmm. Rifle ammo. Alright. A little medical is always good. But we really, really need food. put all my food into the witch, and the witch is not that great. I was thinking she'd be kind of cool just like the wizard was. Even though he became an asshole. <laughs> and most of the characters in this game become assholes anyway. Okay, 
we're just gonna clean this up a little bit. Alright, you're tired already, Sarah? Come on. Well, you know what? They're slow right now. Just keep going. Oh, really? Maybe not. Keep going. Here, you guys take that. I'll take this side here. Take them away. Yeah, rest up a little. Sarah's a good medic, but she's definitely not good for fighting. Okay, we've cleared most of that. Oh, aluminum bat is good. Not for Sarah, but in general. Medical, good. Good. Finally got a little bit of food. We definitely need more, though. Right, there's nothing else here. Go, go, go. Yeah, we just ignored that zombie there. <laughs> ah, here we go. This is the stuff we wanted. that thing went, but still. Here, if you really want something else here, have the have the aluminum bat. You probably could equip it better. Glad that the, the tennis racket finally broke. All right, there's no other supplies, right? What, was, what were you trying to ask me to pick up? A oh, skeleton, no. Eh, purse. That's all. I'm not interested in the purse. Gas is very good. I think that's all the rooms in this house. Not a lot of food. Uh, yeah, that's a side table. Alright, we got enough food for the night, I think. No, 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 we don't. Because everyone eats two. One more food and we'll be good for the night. There it is. Oh, go away. Right now we're more worried about the outside than the inside there. Okay, that's fine over there. There's nothing left to go in, I think. there. I 
I guess I was already in there. Yeah, I was. Jeez, I thought saw something go flying. <laughs> yeah, let's get out of here. The car is gonna be breaking down soon, and no one knows car mechanics. But we got plenty of gas and enough food for the night. Yeah, we eat a decent meal. Row can't shoot him. Sorry, shooting increased his she maxed out her shooting. Uh, man in long red John, he yells, Wish doesn't care, and Sarah doesn't care. It's only the caveman that cares. Aww. We gotta get the morale up. The group stumbles on an abandoned roller skate rink inside his woman zipping around on skates as a zombie lurches toward her. The zombie isn't getting any ground. She has a little twirl, then splatters the zombie with a wrench, never stumbling as she resumes her skate. Sure. I've had her join before. She's got good strength and fitness. That's good. Her composure sucks. It actually turned out to be a nice day today. You're right, what a nice day for a road trip. Uh, which attempt to fix it, I guess. Yeah, she has no mechanical. The group finds there's no food at all. Despair creeps in. Yeah, the witch and the caveman are totally gonna be leaving now. Uh, which thought she spotted a car. And it was just a giant rock. Nerd. Trina didn't notice any of this. Oh. Crappy gas mileage and they're slow. They're also very durable and they break down slowly. Just don't bother taking off jumps. We found a car at least. Grocery store. We need food. You don't really need that. Trina, get rid of that wrench. And I'll give you, well, I was gonna give you that, but I wanna break down some of these weapons here, so let's do that. Since you're the best gunman, Saro, we'll have that. Uh, what else can we get rid of type of things? I guess that'll be good. good. Uh, the kitchen knife is useless. I mean, it's good for until you have something better, and tire irons are so much better than them. Um, aluminum bat is very good. Like I said, I just wanted to break in some weapons, though. The board's good when you really, really need it. That's about it. Wrench. Oh, yeah, we get rid of that wrench. The wrench sucks so much. It doesn't even do that much damage, and it wastes so much energy. I think the scalpel is similar. It, it, actually, I, maybe the scalpel is like strong but short-handed. I'm not sure. In any case, let's go. Sarah, while you get the food. You get the food. Alright, this side's good. Oh, toilet the gas. Oh, we broke some water. I didn't know we could do that. Eh, didn't really do much, but I never knew we could do that. Uh, which is shooting at the place. Great. Good. 
That one's just ignoring us, so whatever. Uh, just the toilets again. I think that's everything here. Unless there's a secret room on the right. No. I don't know what stopped me from moving. Yeah. Let's take this. Excuse me. Yeah, nothing else. We got our food. Let's go. We're gonna need all that gas. And we got enough food now. I can feel it. We're gonna run into something good. Gavin is having crippling tooth pain. Without the precision tools, the only option is to pull the tooth out. I used to be a dentist. Uh, why isn't Why isn't Sarah popping up? She actually has good medical. Why wasn't Sarah doing it? That's stupid. And why is the the witch has better medical than her? Jeez. Can't. The group camps in a sturdy building. It seems to be an old repair shop with busted machinery. Oh, don't tinker all night. That'll just make everyone tired. Five bandits ambush the group while they're about to sneak into the zombie infested house. The bandits speak in half whisper, afraid to attract undue attention. They say, hand them over supplies or they'll yell. Call bluff. One of the bandits yells, chaos emerges. Yeah. Really? These roads are awful. Cars don't last long on them. Well, this is the trader camp, but I don't imagine we'll be doing any business. Welcome to the defensive values, yeah. A witch can rob the doctor? Really? Provides healthcare. Um, I can help you get better at repairing stuff. No. Only the fist will survive. Blah, blah, blah. Shotguns for sale. And there's no weapon buyers, so screw that. This is pointless. I wasn't gonna rob them because we don't need to lower our morale anymore. I hope it doesn't rain. It seems to irritate them. <laughs> Siege time. Alright. We want to get better stuff here, so you can take that. If we really need it, I'll be using the chainsaw. You know, you don't really want that. You won't use that. Um... Here, use the bat if you need to conserve your energy a little. And I'm not using a grenade because it's more than likely it's going to be a close hand quarters, close quarters here. So I will be giving her one of the flashlights just in case we need it. Oh, it's not close quarters. Okay. the house nothing okay. no nope, don't use that yet so I'm gonna pick up the hatchet no because I'm full um, I don't want to give the, I don't want to give Trina or the, the witch the hatchet the, the anything you know just take this Yeah, you're not using that. You can have the hatchet. Trying to exit out. There we go. Here, get more ammo for yourself. Oh, really? Alright, chainsaw it is. No, no, stop. Get off. 
Siege is over already. Alright, you know what? We'll finish these guys off since we're doing okay. And there's no more that's going to be spawning. Yeah, that's why it's good to carry the chainsaw just in case. No supplies there. No supplies there. What did you just pick up? Oh, you didn't. Nothing there. Ooh, shotgun. No. Alright, well, now we have at least different guns, so that's good. Nothing else we're missing here? I don't think so. Let's get out. Well, the gas we got is just the gas that we I brought back from the from my uh, chainsaw, but whatever. We feel inspired. We need morale. All right, which is medical? Sarah's terrible strength. Caveman shooting, which is useless, and Trina's mechanical. Okay. Caveman can't use guns. The group is low on food and eats less? Really? I thought we had just enough. Shoot the moose. You're, you're uh, strong enough. You're, uh, you have really good shooting right now. Shoot the last moose. Group lead gets what stringy meat they can from it before having to leave. But it's good food. It's a good amount of food. We needed it. The group spot some um, buildings, some 12 feet tall littering, got pretty bad into a cup of uh, civilization. The extra large can of baked beans is stuck near the top of the pile. It shines like a beacon of hope. Leave it alone. Climb garbage pile. Smash garbage pile. Smash it. Smash it. Who should fight it? Caveman. It collapses right onto her, but her strength increases. Garbage gets all over her and her morale goes down. Really? I thought she was strong enough that it would be worked, though. Really? Caveman demands that either witch leaves or caveman does. Well, the witch is not as useful, honestly. I'm taking your stuff. The only thing is I fucking bought her, so I'm like, ugh. I wanted to bring both of them, damn it. I mean, the, cave, the, the witch is useful enough. I don't want to get rid of the caveman, though, because she's actually more useful in general. <sighs> Fuck, I hate this. It's because I made her get, fight the gam garbage pile, too. Damn it. Alright, uh... I think I'm selling on the caveman. Caveman feels pretty smug about this. Whoa, it's Nance. Hey, good timing, Nance. You're coming with us. Uh, we'll do the apartment rescue, I guess, because may as well. All right, Nance, you have that, and if I remember right, you, oh, you were just irritating, so you're just kind of like meh about everything. Here, you could have the purse just to knock people around, I guess. I'll put away the sh that. All right, we don't want, we have less shotgun shells, so I'll just keep the snipe, the cowboy rifle on me. We have no ammo for the guns, so we'll do. Who has the zombie leg? You do. I want to use that up, and I, I don't want you holding that. And what else can break? You know, use that too, I guess. You are fine. I'll give you that. 
just to knock him back, because you don't really have good strength at all. Is that a shotgun? Ooh, medical. Right in the grandfather clock. That's the best spot for... Her. Some pistol ammo, that's good. Alright, I know you won't use guns, so I'll just have you hold that. I'll take the nail board just in case. Uh, there. Mobs. When there's a mob, that's when I like to use the uh, nail board. Alright, we got all the supplies that were there. If any. Uh, just the toilet. Go, 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 go. Alright, you broke something, so have the nail board. And a piece of fine wood. There we go. Out of my way. Okay, one little bit of thing here. I broke it already? Really? Huh. Oh, glad you're breaking things in. I guess I'll give you the board here just to, just in case, too. And another one. Just so she has some weapons. Oh wait. Close that door. We don't want any leaking out. Some food. We'll go to the center one first here. Oh, I have room. Okay. Nothing good here. Okay. Oh, hey! Sang says that he really wants to get out of this place. He has to follow you around. Alright, Sang follows Arrow. Say that ten times fast. Oh, jeez, hello. We'll get you out of this place as soon as we're done exploring that, dude. Whoa, Nancy already got bit? Oh. That was really fast. Explored everywhere. Let's get out of here. We got some food, more medical, which we'll heal up Nance with, and a lot of pistol ammo, and a lot more rifle ammo. Stash of 15 food or medical? What do we need more of? Medical's okay. We The food's always useful. We're not bringing you, though. Nance fully healed. Good. We need more morale. Groups have been gas out of abandoned vehicles then spots a magazine in one of the cars. It's an issue of pre prepared, prepper, special edition, mint condition. Who gets to read it? Um, what does it do? I don't know what it does. Uh, we won't be able to share with everyone because Nance sucks. Nance believes in Santa. <laughs> okay. 
Anyway, mm. I don't know what it does, though. Oh, uh, I guess share with everyone. Maybe that'll give everyone a little morale. I assume it's for morale. Well, Sarah and Nance need it more. Give it to Sarah. Uh, this is hypothetical. This was a hypothetical at the time. Zombie apocalypse special issue. Uh, Saro closely studies the firearms tips, emergency medicine, and unusual but effective common repair tricks. So her shooting's already maxed out. So, so now her medical is too. She's still gonna die because that's how it always is. For monsters, zombies are real slow. I'm going to get lazy fighting them. Goop set up the safest place they could find and abandoned mini golf park. Goop eats a decent meal in the morning. They find a golf ball and putter while searching the area. The Goop decided to play a quick game. Sarah gets a fitness. Caven accidentally hits the ball so far that she gets it lost. You know what? That's okay. You didn't purposely do anything, so. Pack grocery store, police headquarters, a big office complex. I'm thinking one of these two. What is our stuff here? We got food, we got some decent ammo. You know, actually, I think the police headquarters will be better because we always want to be stocked on ammo and ammo goes fast. Moderate in hunting. Hmm. All right, I think I can get rid of a couple things here. Um, what do you have, Trina? Well, first, get rid of those. Could hold that instead and the bat. Honestly, I'm just trying to break them out. You don't need that, you could have the hatchet now. Um, I'm just gonna organize my guns here and other necessary weapons are on the top. Then the not so necessary will be on the bottom. Well, that's actually decent. Yeah, it's just those are the only not so necessary. We're okay on that ammo. We're okay on that ammo. All of them are kind of low ish. I think the cowboy rifle will be still be better. Oh wait, why do you have a hatchet? Huh, I didn't know we had two. Okay, well hatchets can be sold, so that's the main thing I love about those. Oh really, we're, we start right into this? Dude. this room. We'll start here. I'll just throw that there. Still, yes. Okay. Go to the right. And of course, it's the bathroom. Well, we'll get a little extra gas. Oh, zombie police officers. I'm sure I've. I've run into them before, I just noticed that they were, though. <laughs> Alright, here's our guns. We mostly needed the ammo, though. Give 
you the shiv. No, you're not taking the zombie leg. They, I saw you gunning for it. Oh, I went this way already. We got one room to go. And I'm gonna close that door so no one follows us. Alright, we can get some food. Decent food. Yeah, that's okay. You can stay there. Uh, nothing good. Your sword snapped. Yeah, I don't really have any other weapons. Uh, I guess you could try shooting if you need to. You know what? Cave in, you're strong. Lift this desk. Run out of strength? Ah, you ran out of strength. Give it a moment, give it a moment, and... There we go. Really? Your... your shiv broke? Ah. really just punch him out. I just like being able to go BAM and then they all fall. Alright, there's some femurs here. Here, you take that. You know what? Let's just run them all over. Um, I think we got everything, right? Another snub nose. Alright. I know that they don't use the have the knuckles. I know they don't use bombs. Your computer characters never do. Alright, I think that's everything we can do. Yeah. Want to move out of my way? Thank you. Oh, Sarah. bathroom. <laughs> uh, there's nothing in there. Alright, police station done. They didn't really have ammo. They had some guns, but no ammo. Or very, very little. The car is running fine, but an error code shows up on the dashboard. The group has no idea what's wrong, so they pull over to see what's up. Trina and carefully inspects it. Try that. And finds the problem is just a loose gas cap, easy to fix. She is below average mechanical, but she can help a little. Okay. This is a bull crap. Really? 
There's a dog wandering nearby. It is keeping its distance, but watching the group with guarded interest, it's become rare to see the, uh, trust people. You have 29 people. I can't. I don't know. I'm sorry, doggy. I wonder if I could get strong enough just to throw cards at the zombies. No, not with your strength. Never. Exhausted at the extra long drive, the group scouts to the camping spot and falls asleep immediately after the group eats a decent meal. Nance and Sarah's morale are going up a little. Are you going to say this is some bullcrap again? So I talk to the next step of the plan. Group drives into the city. Noises from the car have already started to draw attention from the undead. Hardware or athletic? Oh, man. Neither are very good. <sighs> Alright. I don't really need melee weapons, that's the thing. I guess... Uh, I'm trying to think of anything that's actually good. Uh, I mean, sporting equipment, we, we're okay on. So uh, I guess it's hardware, see if something surprises us. Alright, now that we got enough, so many snub noses here... We can get rid of these pistols. Because these could replace the extra pistols, at least. And... You have the brass knuckles. We really don't need that. You should be using this. I'll put this back. We do have another hat. You know, the hatchets also kind of replace the tire irons. No, no, I wanted to throw them all out. And... I think the same thing, the hammers are no longer needed either. You know, take the purse just in case, because it's a good knockdown tool. Caveman's fine. You got your shooting gun here. Mm, but we do have less ammo of that right now. better dolt or a snub nose i don't know i'm gonna go with the dolt because uh i don't know i've always had it and it seems okay you got the hatchet should be fine all right good and we at least enter a town so there's other stuff that can here come in Save uh, the strength of the caveman strength for when there's groups, if I can. Oh yeah, kitchen knife. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. No. What are you? Ice pick? I think that's okay. You know, I'll give that to Nance. Here, I'm out here to take the garbage out. This is what I, I used this her strength for. Really? There was only one. Alright, we finished here. Nothing here. I think there's a little bit. Yeah. No. Fuck off. Anytime I'm the, the cave fan, there's no mobs. But if I'm anybody else, there's mobs everywhere. And eh, mob.
one thing great about the skater girl that we have with us, she's a little extra fast though, when it comes to her movement speed. Did I go in here? Yes, I did. All right, we've been everywhere here. You know, I might do that. Yeah, she's faster. It's because of her skates. I think all sporting equipment is going to be better than the purse. Well, we got some gasoline. That's good. Ooh, those are two by fours. Sorry, literally what they say, just wooden planks. Huh. That makes me a little sad. I've been calling them wrong the whole time. Now I'm just kind of staying in between at the moment just to take a moment to look around. There's no doors in here. No, we're better off just going. Nothing of use was here. The other houses had better stuff. Nothing in that corner. Yeah, we were not in that house. Oh, okay. Here we go. Wow, Nance would rather use the scalpel. Huh. Alright, you can take the cable. That's good. can't take the big table, though. No, oh, you're just gonna smash it. Damn it. I wanted to get that out of the way. Wait, whoa, you can pick that up? Jeez. Well, I guess you could take the table. Close the door. It's a little too fast at times. Alright, there we go. A lot of food at least. We can buy ammo if we need to. Right, nothing else to be grabbed. Alright, now you got your purse. I might take the ice pick just to see how it goes. Medical, good. And jump. I don't know if the ice pick's that good. but only in certain situations. I was there. Okay. Eh, nothing. Get out of there. Yep, I was everywhere here. Okay. Yeah, you're better off with the purse. 
Looks like that's everything. Yep, no sparkles, so yeah, we're good. It's kind of funny that we're still an all-female group here. <laughs> I mean, while it lasts, it'll be good. We shouldn't stop anymore, we should keep on driving. Well, we always need to stop. The road has been flooded out, but it looks like the car could maybe still get through it. The group decides to... let's jump it. The SUV... We're on an SUV. We, our engine is dying. Jumping it won't work. Plow through. Take some damage, but it's fine. Are we talking dinosaur? Are talking dinosaurs still around? Yeah. Uh, the group finds an abandoned campground with a fire pit. The hitman even finds an old, somewhat still, extra large pack of marshmallows. Stories could get our morale up, but marshmallows are better. We're lost, aren't we? <laughs> We could find a used car lot that seems untouched by time, or at least not touched by losers. We find a supply of gasoline and a few working cars. Let's swap to... We're in the SUV and it's guzzling our gas. Let's go to the classic car. It gets a new used car. They don't make them like this anymore. This older model is built real sturdy. It's also easier to repair, but has slightly worse gas mount. Unlike the SUV, which has bad gas mount. Enormous army of undead shambles. Oh, last shop before can't. We're this far in. An enormous army of undead shambles around the carnage uh, that surrounds the border of to Canada. Many have tried to get through. Only most only succeed, having their bodies added to the horde. Maybe your team. This your team will be different. Last chance for trading. What do you want? Spare gas? No. We're using that. That spare gas is going to go to the um, the chainsaw. So. <laughs> You find a woman standing in a stockpile of crate. She wants weapons. No. Right now, I think most of our weapons are fine. Alright, she doesn't want a purse or an ice pick. She will want a couple snub noses. We're fine with one of those and one of the dolts. And a shotgun. You, you're keeping that. Nance, uh, yeah, she might want one of the hatchets at best, that's about it. Uh, anything else I don't mind getting rid of? Well, the ice pick, she doesn't want anyway, but I'm just gonna get rid of it. We'll see if she wants the brass knuckles, too. Sell snub nose. Want the brass knuckles? Huh. But not the hatchet. You know, that makes me think the brass knuckles are actually better than they seem. I haven't really tried them out too much, so maybe I'll just leave them on Nance instead. Get you the hatchet. Okay, yeah, you keep the gun. Yeah, there we go. Keep moving, that's the best way not to get bit. Good luck with Canada. Find the dumpster, drop food for weapons. Hmm. We're actually okay on weapons, we want ammo. No one wants stuff. Okay, no. Homemade spear. We're not gonna tell him to cool it. Erlin's tired of stuck at being stuck at the camp. Beware of the clowns. Nothing but old cans of food. You're a strength trainer. We might do you if there's nothing else here. Uh, swords. No thanks. We're okay. Yeah, I guess we're doing training. 15 food. We're fine. Everyone gets some strength training. Caveman goes up even more. 
Sarah has now almost acceptable strength. <laughs> and Nance now has average strength. That looks good. I wish we could do it one more time, but eh. Because there's nothing else here that's worthwhile. I wanted ammo, though. Yeah, there's no ammo sellers. I was just trying to see if there's any of the uh, cars or shops anyway. Is Death Road really as bad as the name implies? I don't know. Right now I just feel like chopping up some of the skeletons. I don't know if the car takes damage or anything, but just in case it does. Oh, I wonder, can you destroy their stuff? Because you are pretty strong. but there's something satisfying about this. <laughs> okay, enough of that. We gotta get moving. Yeah, nah. Just checking. I like how technically the caveman is driving the car now. <laughs> this cafe doesn't taste bad. bad. Good way to have a positive outlook. Uh, giant armies. Siege. Hide out in the house. You try out the knuckles, and I guess that, no, that's that's crap. That's crap. Here, have a board, and I think guess that'll be enough. Now you know what? You're gonna have the chainsaw. You are gonna have the metal bat just in case. Um. Zero shotgun. Good thing is, you could be just shooting them all up. I mean, you could just be. The caveman can be just knocking them all back like that. Line shooting because I have no idea what's here. I don't even know if everyone's chipping in right now. Siege is over, we can try to escape. Okay. Supplies. What? Food. Bullets. All right. Well, the bullets are what we really needed. The plank. Looks like we're good. All right. Food. Yeah, we're gonna be relying on the rifle because we're out of shotgun. Well, we do have more shotgun. It's okay. Don't forget to check every single toilet for a toilet loot. <laughs> we feel inspired. 
We need morale. We absolutely need morale. I mean, we're almost we're almost there, but shooting's not really going to help much too much more. So yeah, morale. Let's see. Everyone's morale goes up. Everyone else's shooting goes up, except Sarah, who already maxed out her shooting. Yeah, I'm gonna take a moment here to quit and save for a second. Yes, because I'm almost full on Zombo points, so I'm just gonna use them up real quick. More rare traders, extra ZP. Get one ZP every time you recruit someone or something, but we need 15, damn it. More rare traders. Sure, why not? Well, rare traders are not that useful, actually. Gnome. Once you buy a little extra plus of Nomi the Gnome, he uses ZP as currency, and you may buy one thing per game. Besides supplies, you can also sell an extra recruit. No thanks. I'm not using Zombo Points for that right now. Here's what I'm gonna do. Hit the road. Now do it again. Ugh. Damn it. I want to use something from him, but you know what? I guess I'll unlock something random here. Here, trademark weapon. Yeah, I think that'll be enough so I won't have to worry about, um... My Zombo points getting maxed out. We'll go back. Alright, the group prepares for the brutal day ahead of them. Canada's close, but the zombie forecast is bad. Eats a decent meal, but enough for a second meal. Everyone's morale goes up again. Alright, dexterity up time. This time we're doing the siege alert in town. One last siege. Final siege, but not last battle. Sarah's got her ammo full. I don't think there's anything better for you to be holding. Hmm. I guess the, the rifle. Just in case. How is everyone else's shooting? We don't know anything about everyone else. Anyone else's shooting. Great. Nancy has the chainsaw. You know, I'll have her hold it, and that way, if Sarah runs out of ammo, I can just switch over. Trina should be fine, but you know what? I'm gonna give her this. Wait, do we, there's gonna be stuff that I'm gonna be want to be bringing. I want to bring the bombs. That's it. You have the grenade. Aluminum bat's better than the hatchet, and doesn't break. Snubnose not going to be much use. We do want to leave a little bit of wiggle room too. I don't even know if the brass knuckles are that good, but we're going to try this, I guess. Grenades. Who's got grenades? Nance. Okay, get out of there. Ammo, ammo. Katana. Okay, I'm gonna give you the grenades. And I'll take the Otaku Katana here. Sarah, you take the ammo. Get out of here.
Ooh, I got stuck there for a second. We need bombs. Trina, you're up. Guys, move away. And back again. We got way too many right there. Keep moving. Okay, we should be good for now. Oh, crap! Where's Sarah? Is everyone here? Okay, good, good, good. I didn't see everyone. What's in here? Oh, no. Those are room bombs. We're not dealing with those. Worry about the stragglers more than the big mob. I mean, you want to fight off a little bit of the mob, but yeah. Sarah, back to you. Get those. There's more pipe bombs in here. Trina, you're up again. We got them. Go. We're done. Is that everyone? Yes. Okay, good. Watch out, man. Ah, get out of there, guys. Where's Saro? Saro, get out of there. Saro! We are getting mobbed here. Okay. We can go this way, throw a bomb there, and get out. I would love to save everybody. Alright, I created a little bit of a hole here. That should take care of a lot of them. Sarah used up all her shotgun ammo. Great. I also don't know why you're holding that. Stop doing that. She was use using that as a weapon instead. Alright. Sarah, your turn to be shooting. Siege is over and everyone's alive. Go, 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 go. Come on. Supposed to be rad cars, leather, and less waiting. <laughs> All right, this one's gonna be hard. Fort of the Cannon is just north of here. The group must cross the bridge, then reach the fort that serves as the final as a checkpoint right outside Canada. This is the final challenge. Good luck. I don't know what's gonna be different in the deadlier road, other than maybe the mobs are even worse. All right, let me look over my stuff here real quick. Um, also, no drop frames. We're doing good. All right, we don't need the flashlights anymore, so we're fine on that. I really don't know if the knuckles are that good, so I'm just going to give you a hatchet, I guess. Saro, you got the guns. That's good. I'm going to give... No, no, don't give the bat to her, because she's just going to waste it. Uh, we want to make sure she's got mob control whenever there's too many around us. Um... Yeah, I guess Nance can have the shotgun then. Or should she? I don't know. Nance doesn't need the shotgun because she has this to clear the way if she we need to. The shotgun's a clear the way item. Here, I'll switch that. 
the sniper rifle is the cowboy rifle excuse me i keep calling it the sniper rifle should be fine uh you should have that why do you have the cowboy rifle i mean we have the ammo for both so i guess that's not a big deal yeah you know what better to have more than none here we go Thank you, car. You did your job. Imagine how many zombies are going to be here. Can I do the? Yeah, this is going to be a slightly different strategy, isn't it? All right, that's okay. That worked. We had the hole there. All right, we made it to the line. Get ready to hold this line. Actually, there's too many bodies over there. We're just going to go right here. Keep shooting. Because I don't trust the way this might work out. Hey, Piccolo. I'm hopefully surviving this. There's more zombies, so we gotta be careful. I'll be here just lurking, though. Have fun. Thanks, Super Piccolo. I think we might have gotten this. Just in case, though, I'm stealing the gun from you. There we go. Alright, Super Canadian Man. Good job. He actually managed to survive with everybody, too. Holy shit. I mean, we lost some people along the way, but... Yes! We made it. You've got a can do... You got a can-do attitude, eh? Congrats on making it to Canada. The Prime Minister himself makes the Bubon honorary citizens of Canada. He welcomes the last remaining nation. Right? Welcomes you to the last remaining nation on Earth. Three Zombo points. I'm glad I spent those Zombo points before now. <laughs> and we made it with the caveman. Derby champ. Win with the roller derby woman. And the caveman. Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! We got two achievements out of there. So, this is Canada, eh? Yup. It's a bit brisk. Y'all think? Okay, cavewoman. <laughs> hey, look! Penguins! Wait, what? What? There are no penguins in Canada. But ice, snow, penguins! Sigh. <laughs> of course, there's always gonna be penguins. And thank you for the host, Super Piccolo. But we made it to Canada on the deadlier road. More penguins! Soy. But what became of them in Canada? Look at all these suckers. I'll do fine here. Sarah develops a cure for flatulence, which is named after him or her. Urgh, ice everywhere. Caveman took a nap that day and was immediately encased in ice. She woke up in the far, far future. <laughs> that was easy. Roller derby's more dangerous. Trina founded the Mountie Roller Skating Division, feared by all evildoers. Oh, I made it. Nance never got used to the food. Too used to the junk food he she scavenged on the death road. Thank you for playing Death Road to Canada. Try a different gameplay mode. This was Deadlier Road, right? I hope I didn't just finish normal mode. You know what? Let me look at the new game real quick. No, of course not. That's why it was so easy. I actually It wasn't Deadlier Road mode the whole damn time. When I died last time on Deadly Road, it must have reset to dead normal death road, which that's a bunch of bullshit. Damn it, game. Making me think I did something right. Well, we're gonna we're gonna correct that. Anyway, first things first though, we got unlocks. I don't want either of these though. They usually have something different. Fine, more rare traders. 
just to get rid of that. Extra ZP, max ZP increase. Holds it even more. And I couldn't afford that one, so. And we'll get the last trademark weapon. I ran out of perks. You know all, know all I can to teach. Now go and survive. Oh, they're haikus. I didn't even realize that. Alright, we did that. Let's correct this and actually do the deadlier road mode since the game lied to me. I shouldn't have to keep doing, switching it back over. It should be staying on. No. Come on. No! No, we're not doing that. We're gonna start over that. New game. Game mode. There you go. Deadlier road mode. That's what we were supposed to be on. <sighs> Alright. Last time, we were able to do it with Sarah, but she got left out, to be honest. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna start with Scarcy. And. Vera? Hmm. Now, Vera died last time. So. Having one person good for shooting, which is Scarcy. And I guess, uh, Tao? Or. Tao's good with the. With the. Bandits, so we'll go with that. Alright, we'll do that. Rumors, Canada. Dogs are very fast. For fun, ha try having a dog solo loot a city as everyone rests. Yeah, for fun, and watch the dog get killed. Still, that's actually not a bad idea. I never had a dog join me. Let's do the house on the road. Just get, get going. And you have a broom. Okay. And you have a pan. Well, that's a little bit better, so... Somehow we're going to get supplies here. Alright, there's my gun. And the wrong ammo. Really? Take a 2 by 4 and go. Deadly Road's not looking great right now. I think I chose the wrong characters. I needed someone with a more natural fighting skill. And actually, I think, if I remember right, Tal never has really good uh, stamina or strength, so... Scarcy seems slightly more on the ball. I hate when the game lies, though. That wrench is terrible. I'm not dealing with it now. This might take a while, because we are very weak. Alright, you're tired. Tal, you take over. Okay. Pick up another of that, because we're going to need it. Next. They were waiting for us. Back it up. You rather hit the, the, the gun, really? Come on in. We have to take care of these guys because we ain't getting anywhere with this. You know, you're supposed to be resting Scarcity instead of doing that. Ow! 
Oh, don't push me. Scarcity literally just ran into me like that. No, no, no. All right, there goes your weapon. And he doesn't want to use the frying pan for some stupid reason. I'd rather use a fucking butt of the pistol. That took way too long. This is gonna be terrible. I'm picking up the wrench literally just for have a secondary weapon somewhere. We are way out of shape. Oh good. Femur. These are actually decent weapons. Also, so we don't get stuck up on. And there goes that decent weapon. Alright, we got bullets. And I dropped my garbage can, great. Get out of there, Scarcy. Stop attacking. Here, give it to me, and I'll give it back to you. You can shoot now. Now that he can shoot, he switches to the wrench. Great. Alright, that's one side done. Uh, I guess I'll pick up the screwdriver and give that to him. Oh, we, one of us did get bit? Scarcity got bit. Okay. Alright, we got more bullets. Get out of there. There's nothing else in there. And let's get the fuck out of here because this was just a huge time sink. It gets late. No great place to camp. Who should stay up on watch? I guess to Al. He managed to stay awake. His loyalty is actually very good, huh? Yeah, Tal's a makeshift healer. He's not a great healer, but he can heal a little. Oh, they encounter a library. Give me one second. Okay. What we could do is repair manual, self-help book on positivity, rhyming children's book. Our morale's just okay. Let's go with the repair manual. Neither of us are good with that. I'm not really counting on these two surviving long, though, because if anything I've learned in the Deadlier Road mode is don't worry about training people. You just want to get guns and good weapons. Strength and fitness or coffee shop. Hmm. We could do strength and fitness. Uh, it'll cost us some damage, but you know what? That'll be good for us. There's nothing really extra great in... Um, okay, I don't want you using the wrench. The wrench sucks. There's nothing really great in a coffee shop. It just lets you loot a little bit faster. Oh yeah, I forgot. I'm a little extra tired because I stayed up. Uh, I know I sound frustrated at the moment. I'm, I'm just really annoyed that I thought I made it and I ended up not making the candidate in deadly road mode. Since you're tired, Tal, it'd be a bad idea if you jumped on. So you do it, Scarcy. Light exercise. Pave the road. He's, he sets the stationary cycle to pave the road on the moon and such his legs. Good exercise for him due to being very out of shape. <laughs> Fitness increase. Can we do more? No way, it's touched, covered in sweat. No way, you gonna do it anymore. All right. It's his own to sweat, but sure. Oh, that's a dumbbell I'm pushing. Well, we got a little pick train. Alright, 
screwdriver sucks. Beginning, you definitely want to have melee fighters, and Scarcy and Tal are not it. Tal's more for when bandage attack. I really don't like wasting the ammo like that, but we had to. Well, we should be. Okay, Femur, good. Femurs are very good weapons. They just break very easily. No more femurs there. But they're light and they do good damage. Not great, good enough though. And you could, and they're recyclable because you can keep finding them. Nothing there. Uh, I guess that's not recyclable so much as they're common. No knockback on them though. That zombie leg that Saro found in the last one really, really was good. All right, a little more medical. Get some more medical there. Shotgun ammo. Now we just need a sh not shotgun, uh, rifle ammo. Sorry. Now we just need a rifle. Oh, here's the supplies. I think the kitchen knife's slightly better, and I'm gonna give you the screwdriver just in case you need something else. The kitchen knife's not great, but I. Oh, it's about the same as the screwdriver. It does about three hits to kill. Alright, well, while they're busy with that, we can explore the rest of the house. Medical. Shotgun shells. Food, that's good. As Gauntlet has taught us, food is good. And if you don't know the reference, you're probably too young. <laughs> or never played Gauntlet. Any houses to loot down here? Alright, nope. Let's get the hell out of here. Hi, zombie mob. We're not interested. But thank you for your, uh, interest. Bye bye Alright, decent food. Gas will fold over for now. It's not great. Alright. Group camps on a big field. A decent meal. And row cans. Alright. Is Tal's morale okay? Mm, it's gonna go down, but we need to get some practice in. Yeah, Simpsons reference. Scarcy doesn't care, but yeah, Tal's morale is gonna go down. If you have high loyalty, you care. If you have low loyalty, you don't care. And these are the ones. Send a scout to explore the loot. I think Tal's good at that because he has good wits, right? Oh, but he has a bad attitude, but good loyalty. I think Tal's okay. Yes. So it's scavenging. And extremely paranoid about every step in action. Yes, paranoid works out. He's ready for every single one of them. Pistol ammo, good ones. Wow. Rifle, food, medical. We need a rifle still and a shotgun, but <laughs> awesome. Trader camp. If it's something cheap, I'll get it. You're looking for good weapons? Yeah, I don't think we have anything for trade for that at all. Yeah, we we don't got anything. I could rob her, but uh, 
that'll lower Cal's morale even more, and I don't want to do that. Well, we're in a scientist uh, place. Oh, right, buy teleporter, maser pistol, or recruiter. No thanks. We're not. We don't have enough food to really warrant bringing her along. Let's see, five blue robot. Oh, it helps do battle, but it's only temporary. It's similar to uh, when you find chicken in the wild. What do you do? Oh, I'm guessing you're a silencer person, right? Yeah. Silence pistol? No. I mean, I never used them, but I don't, never found a use for them either. Maybe they are useful in some scenarios, but eh. We have better reasons to hold on to our food right now. New person, Jeanette. She's alone. Claims she wants to join the team. She claims to be great at fixing cars and machinery. She said she used to be kind of an engineer, but is based about what kind. But Tal has a re has a gut feeling this is a lie. Yeah. I need another body though. Congratulations, you're gonna be the person that we get rid of first. I have a feeling that camera is gonna be a waste of time. Well, you're a bitch, aren't you? Jeez. I mean, she, we already know she's lying. Oh, uh, we gotta go through the sores. And she has a fucking wrench, great. I think I might need the wrench too, because at least it's strong enough and we're just gonna go through our fitness way too fast. And we need a flashlight too. I don't need two flashlights. Oh wait, Jeanette here. You can also have a kitchenette because I don't care about you. Just gotta keep moving. Hurry, hurry, get through. I mean, I will leave you behind, but I'd rather not. All right, we're done. Guys, get over here. No! There we go, jeez. Uh, Wines us about how people smell and lowered our fucking morale. Great. We need the morale now, thanks to you, bitch. Alright, morale goes back up. Scarcity's mechanical goes, Tal's strength, and Jeanette's shooting. Good. I don't really care about Jeanette. Enjoy the smell or drive with no sleep. Can we really take another morale hit? If we drive with no sleep, though, we're screwed even more. Ugh, this just sucks, doesn't it? I'm gonna take a risk with the morale. Endure the smell. Yeah, we could take a, one hit to morale. I can't wait to get out of this car and stretch my legs out. Alright. Hardware store might be good for just getting general weapons, I think. Bullet ridden house might have bullets in it, maybe? Yeah. I'm not sure. But for now, I'm gonna say, let's get some basic weapons. Because we're using way too heavy of weapons right now. <laughs> two-by-fours. And it broke. This is going to be way, way too much. Here, you hold that. I'm going to take the stabber here. Ooh, rubber mallet. Those are good. 
At least I think they're good. Higher knockback or something? Here, you, you finish them off. A weed whacker? Oh, that that's not very good, if I remember right. Oh, well. Get rid of the wrench for a normal hammer. And I'll give the hammer to you. So I can get rid of this wrench, because wrenches suck. I'll give that to you. Get some gas. I guess we could sell the weed whackers at best. Oh, I don't want to be actually using it, though. Well, we're getting supplies. That's good enough. We got some new weapons. Useful ones, at least. Eventually, I'm going to get rid of that frying pan. Here, you have the empty one for now. I'm going to give Tal... I'll give Tal the one with gas. No, no, he'll actually use it, so no. I'm just trying to think of any other weapons I can give be given... All right, femur. We're gonna give the femur right to you, Tal, and I'm gonna pick up the mallet again. Uh, you're tired. Damn it. Sledgehammer is sellable. You know what? I'm gonna go switch to Jeanette real quick just to have her hold that instead. Oh, really? Hammer. The hammer sucks. I want the rubber mallet. Oh, you got the rubber mallet. Why are you guys taking those, really? I really sometimes hate the AI like that. You don't have the strength for the thing there, Scarcy. Jeez. All right, we got toilet gas coming up. There we go. I mean, the 2x4s aren't a big deal. They're, they break too fast, so we don't really need to be grabbing those. Some toilet gas and get the fuck out, get the fuck out. Go, go, go. We have the rubber mallet at least, right? Yes. Because the rubber mallet is very important. I used to think the frying pan was good, but uh, based on how we could start with it, it usually means it's not. Pitchfork. Here, we'll just do this. What are you? A blowtorch? That's useful. Alright, I'll take the rubber mallet. What the fuck did you drop, Scarcy? Really? You dropped the thing for a goddamn normal hammer. Stop taking the hammers, you idiot. Ay. And the blowtorch we want. And then I'm gonna switch the towel. And don't you dare pick up that goddamn hammer again. Branch trimmer. I'm thinking of stuff to sell right now. I think the branch trimmer sells okay. It's not a really good weapon. Anyway, we did got what we came for here. We got weapons. That's all we needed here. So, time to head back. Yeah, see, that does not do much. Rubber mounts, for sure, is much better. Here, move gear to sell. Weed Whacker is eventually going to be sold. Maybe the Blowtorch, too, because I tried using it once and it wasn't working out well. You can keep the... 
the hammer thing, though. The rubber mallet, too, will keep. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, dog wandering nearby. You know what? I'm gonna hate myself for this. I already know this, but I'm gonna recruit a dog. I say hate myself because I don't want to see a dog die. I really, really don't. Come on. Lures Callie over food. She knows a good source of meal. She sees it, decides to stick around. Honestly, I hope she just runs away from us or something. Something is worth it to run past a horde instead of fighting. Yes, it is. Group can't find the car keys. Great. Tiring him out will get him killed. Tal will get you get killed. Scarcy, you have a decent shot. Shoots at the gator. Whips the shot. Gator swallows the keys and waddles away. His shooting sucks. He's supposed to be a natural shot. <sighs> Alright, we found a bakery van, at least. Morale goes up. Fortunate to find an abandoned cabin in the woods to stay the night in. Shortly after getting setting up, the storm moved in. Luck for them, they found a cabin. So we had a little luck. Jeanette finds a car in the middle of the road. We gotta find the some car keys. Oh, we found some keys. Okay. Uh, nearby how I abandoned cars. They're broken, but a little bit. Would you like someone to siphon the gas out? Callie is a dog. Dog used to be pets. Now most are feral. Uh, doesn't hold eye contact. She has terrible loyalty. You know what? I don't care about her. Jeanette, you do it. She's the first one out if we find someone better. Because fuck her. Let's see. While on this road, the group decides to make a stop for supplies. Fancy office or swarmed rest stop. The rest stop would have food. Fancy office. I don't know. Uh, fuck it. Time to explore. All right, since she's tired, she really shouldn't have the sledgehammer. She could have that. So I'll have the blowtorch just in case. And if it's crowded in there, as soon as we step in and there's like no outside, we're just gonna leave. Okay, good. Being outside gives us a shot. Guys. Nope. I think once they're on fire, you can go through them or something. I don't know. This is looking very unfortunate right now. I think we're going to take our time with this one. No! Don't get hit! Rubber mallets push them away, but I guess they don't have good strength or something. Doggy, get over here. Alright, I'm about to say fuck this. This is not working. No, you know what? We gotta go at least inside. We gotta get something. Anything. There we go. We got food. Oh, the dog looks like Lassie. Alright, this is a good place to lure in the extra zombies and then go around them. Really? You're not dead. 
Dude, what are you doing? What is wrong with you? You just stood there. No, no. What the fuck was wrong with Scarcy? Jeez. That is crap. Here, have a rubber mallet. Isn't there ammo around here, or did he take it all with him? Damn it, Scarcy. Why would you run in there and then just go, duh? Hey, you want some body? You want a body? Over here. Oh, don't, don't burn the dog. Stop that. Why aren't you going after Scarcy's dead body? He deserved it after he was such an idiot. Alright, this is another bathroom. Not worth it. Get out of there. Really? Go. And now I have to deal, stay with Jeanette. Fuck Jeanette. <laughs> we don't have the weapons to deal with that. Finds a candy bar, who eats it? Whoever has the lowest morale that isn't Jeanette. Alright, Tao. barricade the house oh um she has terrible mechanical the dog's not gonna have any mechanical i guess tau could drive eh, they're flimsy but he managed to keep the zombies out okay good oh the dog only eats one food at a time that's cool uh abandoned hideout boarded up house not much left here except a small battery powered TV hooked up to an old VHS player. There's only one movie in the videotape player. A fitness, a sumo, action movie, or comedy film. Well, comedy will be for morale. Action, I don't know what that would do. I guess shooting? Sumo would be strength. Fitness. We want fitness. The group follows the fitness instructor on the videotape. Everyone's wearing neon sweatband. Tal and Jeanette and Kelly's fitness increases. And morale up, too. Cool. TV shorts out of the movie and is left behind. Started to rain, zombies, blah, blah, blah. Camp supplies or furniture. We want food. Apparently, uh, Scarcy used up all the pistols, and blowtorch is not working out for us right now. So I guess I'll, use, I'll be the one to use a sledgehammer sometimes. And, and Callie, you're in job of be your job is being cute. I don't think they could wield weapons, dogs, so... Go away. Stop that. Another rubber mallet? Really? They're just littering this place with rubber mallets. Tired. Jeanette, you're taking over now. Whether you like it or not, you're going out there and fucking fighting. Nothing there. Nothing here. There, you die. Here, have a piece of wood, why not? Hmm. 
I wonder if I give him a bone, if that'll make him, well, happier, I guess. Yeah, he's got a bone! Oh, he can fight with the bone, that's fu Oh, he didn't. Never mind. He just holds the bone, that's it. <laughs> Why are you using the... That... That... That's so dumb. We are taking that rubber mallet back. Damn it, Tal! Damn it, Tal! Stop it! No. You're not dying. You're. I'm done with you just kind of running up and going, duh. The AI seems terrible right now. Here, she, Jeanette can have it, because that way Jeanette can be the one to die. I really don't care for her. She lied, so. Oh, no. No. Sorry, no. Tal's not dying. No. You can dodge in it. I don't care. Right, we got a house down here to investigate. This is what happens when you don't have fighters. Ugh. I definitely should have brought Crag or something, buddy. I'm gonna be... Let's try being Cali. Oh, wow, you're fast. Maybe you're better... Not a better protector. You're good at Weaver. You go in and out and go, yeah. Oh, doggy's tired now. We got bullets, good. They did say, why don't you try having a dog just looting the place for you. As long as it's not mobbed, they can do it, probably. Nothing there. Are we gonna die? Probably. Go, go, go. Good. Alright, we're good there. Go, guys. Nothing. Oh, wait. Toilet gas. Air bullets. Here, take that. Alright, get out of there. Anyway, move, move, move. Nope, nothing there. Wow, dogs really are so fast. Again, as long as there's no mobs, dogs are amazing. stuff in there. Can you actually hold this? No, you can't. Okay. Nothing good. Nothing good. Alright, back in there. Dogs can't lift anything. Food and go. Uh, bullets. Yeah, that's what the humans are for, is just to make sure the mobs disperse. Alright guys, come on, come on, come on.
Make sure they're okay, good. All right, Dougie, go in the car and drive for us. <laughs> the dog's driving. Good Cali. I might have to utilize the dog a little bit more. But yeah, Scarcy was an idiot. He just stood there. So. Shoot golf balls. Drive with no sleep or prepare for siege. I am not doing a siege. Drive away with no sleep. Slow down a little. Could you shut up a little? Callie says, should you shut up a little? What the fuck? <laughs> the dog just talked. Accept challenge, ram into car. How's the vehicle looking? Chassis is fine. Ram into his car. Before the drag race can start, the group plows into the car, their car into the opponent's car. Both cars take damage, but the opponent's vehicle takes a lot more. You win the race. The annoyed driver runs away, screaming cheater. The group siphons some gas from his wreckage. And our morale goes up for that. We will probably run out of gas before we get to Canada. We're doing okay. We're going to probably run out of food before we get to Canada. We find a traitor. I'm a dog. I am a dog. He's selling anime. Callie could tell him to cool it? What the fuck? Callie! Looking for great weapons? Oh, we do have stuff. We have weapons. Not the sledgehammer. That can go over there for now. We are selling one of these and one of those. Yeah, I don't have it. There we go. Wait, who's holding it? Oh, of course, Tao. Weed whacker for two food. And the branch trimmer. Shotgun shells. We don't have enough food to be buying those. From there, I think I already talked to you. You're selling anime, and that's it. We're all tired, though. Hmm. Overwhelmed by a horde, and flees a nearby factory. It must be a weatherway inside. Oh, we have to go through the factory and find an exit. Great. Oh, I forgot to try to sell the blowtorch. Well, you know what? Get rid of it. Here, use this and a rubber mallet. You can have your hammer back and I guess don't bother with the sledgehammer. Um, one of those. And Callie, you stay being cute. Oh, Bart. I don't know what barking does, though. I'm afraid it just calls attention. Oh, crap. I forgot to get the guns. Damn it. We're screwed. Just keep running. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything we want to pick up anyway. Bad idea. Alright, don't bother with that side. Just keep going this way. Give it a moment. Let him go this way, take up the stragglers here. Guys, don't fight those ones. Go this way, and over. Come on, there. Where are you? A blowtorch again? Dog with a blowtorch, great. 
Uh, I think we're better off going around. We have two rooms here. What's here? Oh, uh, we have supplies here. Let's take them. No one's taking the hatchet. Great. Well, you take the hatchet and give it to one of them. Ammo, ammo, ammo. Okay. Give it a moment, give it a moment, give it a moment, rest up. There. Oh shoot, 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 shoot. Doggy! Doggy's too fast, jeez. here. Doggy's tired. Jeanette, your turn. Okay, Tal, your turn. Alright. Callie, your turn. It's a dead end. We're so screwed. Oh boy. Yeah, the dog's got to basically do like almost all the work here. Jeez. Take a look at my... Alright, no drop frames. We're doing good. Oh, it says right there, deadlier mode. Road. I could have noticed that the whole time when I was going through this before. Uh... Oh well. Actually, I've been on for two hours. I think that'll be it for now. I might come in and continue this later. I always say that. I don't know, but we definitely need guns and such. Either way, I do need a break. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you, Super Piccolo, for the host and for lurking. I appreciate it. Uh, anyone else watching this on YouTube, thank you for watching as well. See you guys next time, and hopefully we'll survive this one this time, maybe. Bye-bye.